Hello everyone, I'm Brian Croy Dragon, and welcome to today's Tales from the Crypt Keeper commentary. It is Uncle and Harry's Horrible House of Horrors. Let's get started. Fluid flowing. <laughs> Yikes! Wait a second! You're not Paul! Vault Keeper, still trying to steal my show? And there's nothing you can do about it this time, Crypt Keeper. Behold my new stretch magic! Prepare for a workout you'll never forget. Just a little adjustment and... <clears throat> Something to be said for a low-fat diet. Away we... Uh-oh. Oh. Oh. Again. Keeper stretches his legs. Today's fiendish fable is about Uncle Harry, who let the years bury his funny bone and turn him into a grumpy old deadbeat. I call it Uncle Harry's Horrible House of Horrors. <laughs> He gets one ride, and then we go home. Oh, Harry. We could have all had double helpings at the pork, pickle, and pie for less than what these crooks are charging. Oh, now, Harry, don't fuss. After all, it's Jeremy's birthday, and we're here to have fun. <sighs> well, Jeremy, it's your special day, so you lead. Okay, Aunt Dorothy. Is it just me or is the voice synced off? No, no, wait, let's see. I, first I want to go on this one. No, no, wait, let's see. Okay, okay, I want to go on that. No, 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 let's see. First I want to go No, wait. Hey, no, okay. Oh, okay, okay. Wow! The Zipper Dipper! No way. Grant Dorothy and I are not about to peel you off the pavement. Harry. What? Everyone knows they just slap those things up overnight. All the case of one loose bolt and splat. 
You're as good as pavement butter. Harry? Okay, okay. The fun house. I want to go in the fun house. Oh, can I go in the fun house, Uncle Harry? Can I? Huh? Can I? Can I? <laughs> the fun house? What's fun about walking into walls and mirrors? <laughs> you can do that at our house. <sighs> Forget it. You're going to hurt yourself, kid. How about the rotor? I don't even want to know what that is. Merry-go-round? Isn't that for girls? <sighs> Water in that pistol to block any bullet. Right here, ladies and gentlemen, right here we have a winner. Well, they, you know, they have to give a prize to someone to make it look honest. I'm telling you, Dorothy, they pay kids to walk around with those toys. Uh huh. Cool. No need for candy floss, son. I guarantee your teeth will rot soon enough by himself. You know, Harry, it wouldn't hurt if you tried to have some fun for once in your life. Ha! <laughs> fun. Life is not fun and games, Dorothy. It's work, more work, and if you're lucky, a couple of disappointments sprinkled in between. But Jeremy's just a child, and it is his birthday. Hmm. <laughs> what does that have to do with anything? Yeah, I'd say it. Cool. Let's have your fortune read by Delma. Not that. Computer printout provided. Um. I say we all go in and have our fortunes read. Yeah. I've got a better idea. Why not let Aunt Dorothy go on ahead? Yeah, we're getting a bit of commercials we'll in between or something. Way. I'm hearing a little bit getting or ending of a commercial. I don't know. Sheep's clothing. <laughs> Whoa. Ah! What in Sam Hill? to a word I've said. When it comes to ripoffs, this place wins top trophy. You promised, Uncle Harry. One ride for my birthday. And this is the one I want. Then, then we can go home. Okay. Alright! But as soon as it's over, we go home. That's just their way of saying you're not getting your money back when the ride breaks down. Which more than likely 
Christmas lights painted green. Look out! <laughs> this some fake fur glued on top of a cheap plastic head. <laughs> <laughs> and it's even missing an eyeball for crying out loud. It's an even bigger disappointment than I thought it would be. I don't know. They look pretty real. That's not right.
Who would believe it? Wonder what he saw. Full of weird things. And the arms! Tell her about the arms, Uncle Harry! Yeah, the arms. They, 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 they were all over me and they were on my head and uh, I couldn't stop them. And then, then there was a cemetery. The dead guys rose from the grave, Aunt Dorothy! And one of them was trying to pull me out of the car! But the sign says to stay in your seats, didn't it, Uncle Harry? Yeah, but before that, this giant tree branch sucked me up and spit me out again. I don't remember that. It chewed up my head! Look! Tell her about the end, Uncle Harry! Tell her about the end! Oh, oh yeah, yeah, a pendulum, swinging back and forth and back and forth, and nearly got us, Dorothy, I swear it did! <laughs> Dorothy, you have to believe me, I, I know how this sounds! It sounds like two six-year-olds who have just had the time of their lives. We sure did! It sure was great, Uncle Harry! I knew you'd have fun! Fun? But the creatures, the, the bats. The bats are pretty good. What did you say they were made of? Styrofoam? <laughs> it wasn't real? Of course not. It doesn't matter. We still had fun. I did? I think you did, Harry. I have to admit it, I, I really was scared. <laughs> I mean, how silly. A, cr a crazy haunted house and I was scared. <laughs> Things jumping out at me and... You know, booga, booga, booga. <laughs> I, th I thought it was real. <laughs> Can you imagine that? <laughs> how ridiculous. <laughs> booga, booga, booga. <laughs> yeah, I did have fun. <laughs> but, <laughs> young man, a promise is a promise. Time to go home. Just kidding, just kidding. <laughs> Go home? Are you kidding? I'm just getting warmed up. All right. Oh, oh yes, sir. Okay, okay, okay. I want to go see this. I want to go see. No, no, wait a minute. I want to go see. Sorry. The fortune teller was right. Then we can. Okay, okay, okay. We can go. You know what? The zipper dipper. <laughs> Come on, kid. I bet I can beat you there. Very good. Come on. Last one. There's a. The ability to enjoy life is measured in the depth of one's imagination.
Yeah, that's a, this is a great one. Uncle Harry's Horrible House of Horrors. Uh, I really enjoyed that one. I'm Brian Croydragon signing out. Stay Shrey.